Okay, so let's cover tilt angle with the shoulders in both the backswing and the downswing. This is something that I recommend, especially for beginners, to understand how to create tilt in your body. It's the number one fault I see with beginning players with poor ball striking. So what is shoulder tilt? So I can bend my sides to the left and I can bend it to the right, right? So both bends are required in a golf swing. So what I have here is I have a setup where I'll set up to the ball that I'm intending to hit with another ball about two feet outside of that. And what I'll do is I'll place the club on my shoulder so that the grip is on the lead side, the club is on the trail side. And I wanna make sure that I sit up in the right distance for the club. And then I put the club right on the shoulder. Now, in the backswing, I want to create a tilt where the club or the grip is pointing to that outside ball. So if I see a player who gets a little flat, you're gonna notice that the grip points out to the side. And a player who has too much tilt would be tilting down to the actual ball. So the proper amount of tilt is about two feet outside of the ball that you're gonna hit. Okay? So just trace that shoulder and get the grip to go to the outside of the ball. Now the downswing, what we're gonna do is we're gonna trace the right shoulder down to the actual ball. So once I complete my backswing, I'm gonna trace my shoulder down and I'm gonna get that right shoulder down to the ball, okay? So in the downswing, if you're a player who feels like they throw down at it, whether it's from the top of the backswing or maybe you get to here and you start doing a good job and you're in this spot and you also throw down here, then this would be a good feel for you to trace the shoulder all the way down to the ball. So we want to feel like the right shoulder goes to the ball, but it doesn't stop here and then you throw the arms or worse, you throw it from the top and this right shoulder or the chest does not turn through the shot. So give this a uh, give this some practice, but it's a great drill for you to feel what tilt angle is like for both the backswing and the downswing.